Hey guys, that's Mog91 here. So we're back for more Persona 3 Fez. And we're gonna find out what the hell the Dark Hour is. The Dark Hour occurs every day at 12 midnight. You could say it's the Hidden Hour. During this time, an ordinary person transmogrifies into a coffin and is oblivious to all that occurs. Then he must be... As you can see, he's retained his human form. He's asleep, but he's definitely experiencing the dark hour. The only question that remains is whether or not he has the potential. Although, he must. If he didn't, they would have preyed on him by now. Scary. In any case, we should continue to monitor him for a few more days. Yes, sir. <laughs> I feel kind of bad, though, spying on him like this. Yeah, that's kind of fucked up. to the velvet room, my dear young man. The velvet room. This is going to be a place where we spend a lot of time. My name is Igor. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This is Elizabeth. She's a resident here, like myself. Pleased to meet you. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. It's been years since we've had a guest. <laughs> so that's a little signature we did at the beginning, of, well, the end of the first episode. Only those who have signed the contract can enter this place. Henceforth, you shall be welcome here. In the velvet room, you are destined to hone your unique ability, and you will require my help to do so. I only ask one thing in return, that you abide by the contract and assume responsibility for the choices you make. Yep. That's understandable. Hold on to this. The velvet key. Till we meet again. Velvet Key will let us enter this area. But to find the area, that is another question. This is going to be a very interesting game. Although it's set back in 2009. It felt like you had a strange dream. However, it's time to go to school. Okay. Oh, the moon's full. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. The moon cycle, guys, is very important to keep an eye on. You'll understand why later. Hey, there's a uh, Jupe. Or Jup. Jupe. What up, man? Today's the perfect day. Sky is blue. We're young. What more could we ask for? Well, you're for all of energy? Of course, dude, listen to this. Oh, wait, I'm not supposed to say anything. Sorry, man. <laughs> okay. Wait, what the fuck, dude? Well, yeah, no. So, let's see, I do not own Persona 1 and 2, I don't know what the difference between Fez, actually I don't know if there really is too big of a difference between Fez and then uh, Persona 3, but if there is, I'll find that out. <laughs> I'm Mr. Iko, Ikoda, Ikoda, I'll be teaching your classic literature, I'll be... I'm teaching you about the good old Japan all years. Some people say classic lit isn't relevant to everyday life, but oh, how they're wrong. Students, uh, the other teachers, wrong, wrong, wrong. No one really understands cl classic lit. You feel tired. Close your eyes for a few minutes. Share. Go to sleep. And it knocking out or something. 
school. So you can either stay awake for class and get smarter, or you can sleep through class and they don't care. Random cat with a girl. To get a guy and a girl talking. Random kid. The station is bus full with students on the way home. No surprise. So we still don't have an actual control of how what we want to do in the afternoon. But I believe that's going to change in the next day or two. And welcome to the midnight hour. The dark hour. Time to wake up. <laughs> we are going to go through the dark hour. Same as last night. Hmm. Very interesting. Even those who have the potential tend to be unstable at first. Memory loss, disorientation. But this subject is rather unique. He hasn't exhibited any of the common symptoms. But we're treating him like a guinea pig. I understand your concern, but it's imperative that we recruit new member. I heard he's your classmate. Wouldn't you be more comfortable working with someone from the same grade? Yeah, I guess. But still. Command room. Is that you, Akihiko? You're not gonna believe this. This thing is huge. Unfortunately, I don't have time to talk. It's chasing me. I wanted to let you guys know. I'm almost there. Okay, sorry guys. I gotta let my cat out. He wants to go out. He's been sleeping this whole time. So, that's pretty good though if he's been sleeping through this whole uh, recording session so far. And I just popped my leg and that got hurt. Okay. Shit. Does that mean he's bringing that thing here? Mr. Chairman, let's suspend our observation for now. We'll prepare for battle. Right. <laughs> so guys, you're gonna finally find out what's in the dark hour. And it's gonna be some it could be some scary ass shit. There's one thing I've noticed with that was the games that I've played through them are all kind of RPG horror games. Senpai. Or they're very dark. I'm alright. Get ready to be surprised. It'll be here any second. This is no time to joke around. It's one of them, Akihiko? Yes, but not an ordinary one. <laughs> what the? You've got to be kidding me! Mr. Chairman, please head for the command room. Takuma, go upstairs and wake him up. Then escape out the back. But what about you two? We'll stop it here. You let it to us, Akihiko, so I'm afraid you'll have to fight. <laughs> like I had a choice. Nice. What are you waiting for, Yukari? Go! Yep. I'm going. <laughs> you open by a loud noise and hear a commotion down in the hall. So I'd go take a look. Alright, I'm already up. Sorry. I don't have time to explain. We have to get out of here now. What's going on? <laughs> Hurry, downstairs. We'll leave through the back door. Wait. Take this, just in case. Okay. A short sword. Okay. So we finally got our first weapon. Atlas sure does know how to put on a good shell. If you want to wait a little while, this gets very dark and interesting. All right. Talk about. Yes, I hear you. Be careful. There's more than one enemy. The one we're fighting isn't the one Akihiko saw. What? Shit. Uh, let's yeah. 
definitely got to pull back because we don't know what's going to happen. This would scare the living shit out of you if this was really going. What are, what's going on? What are we going to do? Down the stairway. We don't have any choice but to go up further. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are we going to do? Well, let's just keep going up. No point in hiding. Guys, I'm going to go ahead and call it an episode here. Next time, we'll find out what the hell is chasing us. Okay, guys. Peace.